hearing tonight the pleas for help that a Lancaster woman made after police say she was stabbed in her home by a stranger. News 8's Lancaster reporter Meredith Jorgensen joins us with the update. Susan, um, I'm sorry, Kim, Ellsworth Bodden spent the morning in an orange jumpsuit in court today facing those attempted homicide charges. And during the preliminary hearing, we heard the victim's voice for the first time, Kim, as she called 911 moments after she was stabbed. Courtroom 2 inside the Lancaster County Courthouse was silent as the prosecution played a recording of the 911 call the night Annika Horn was stabbed. I'm dying, she told the dispatcher. She said she had been stabbed in the neck. The dispatcher asks, how many times were you stabbed? She calmly replies, a lot. Now, 23-year-old Ellsworth Bodden is charged with the crime, accused of stabbing the victim 21 times during the early morning hours of September 7th. Police testified Monday they tried to box Bodden's Honda in when they saw him fleeing the 400 block of West Orange Street two weeks ago. Mr. Bowden uh, had an arrest warrant out of New Jersey because he didn't show up for, for probation. So there was a reason why he was trying to get away from the police officers. Police interviewed Annika's neighbors in the days after the stabbing, some of whom attended Monday's hearing. A fundraising website has raised about $50,000 for the 29-year-old who is still hospitalized. On it, a message from her family. It reads in part, she's progressing. She continues to be a fighter. Thank you. Well, other details that we learned from the hearing, Bodden's girlfriend actually lives next door to the victim, Annika Horn. Police say Bodden also stole a jar of quarters from Annika's house and then used them to pay for a taxi cab after he ditched that black Honda. And investigators also alleged that Bodden stole a Glock handgun from Annika's house, which police later found at Bodden's friend's house in Ephrata. The judge ruled that there is enough evidence to go to trial. In Lancaster, I'm Meredith Jorgensen for News 8.